up guys and welcome back to the vlog I'm still not feeling well but I'm getting better I'm almost at my best of um, health condition I just have this little um, cough that, that, that makes that my throat so itchy but <coughs> doesn't have a phlegm anymore and a little cold uh, yeah I'm I'm dressed up cuz I'm going out I'm going to the mall I sh I should be worried going out cuz it's gloomy it's about to rain and the reason I got flu because I was caught in the rain I came from the gym that time and when I went home I was caught in that I was caught in the rain I actually don't like rain cuz uh, I can't do anything. It made me so lazy. The coldness, the the coldness made me so lazy. So yeah, I'm about to go to the mall for a food shopping. But here's the thing: I'm on my uh, lowest point of my financials as of now, cause I'm not yet being paid with my boss, which is quite long already I should have received my six weeks salary yes I should be paid every other week but it's been six weeks this is actually the seventh week that I am not yet being paid and I'm really holding to a little money that I have on my ATM but I, I actually understand my, my boss because just like her I'm also renting but of course at the same time I also have uh, personal obligations monthly obligations so uh, I also need money to buy food though so I actually don't have plans to go home for this weekend because because of that financial if I go home I need to bring money because most of the time I also offer food when I got home anyhow yeah I need to go to the mall also to train myself because I'm getting well I need to celebrate that I really hate getting sick because ow, my arms hurt Wait. because look I'm, I'm living alone and no one cares though I'm already grown up but course it's really different when there's someone to take care of you so for me to celebrate I need to treat myself I don't know where but I am thinking of course again to my favorite you know, food court and I also wanted to watch Justice League I wanted to go out on Sunday but of course I'm really holding on the last money I have of course my most important thing to to use with this money is of course to have a little food shopping I can buy myself I mean I can treat myself for a cinema because uh, I I have this extra allowance that I'll always save I I'll always um, put into place when I am um, dividing my salary so I am always having this little um, allowance for, for whatever I want yes I am now leaving but I need to shut my laptop first see you at the mall Oh my god, I'm in a hurry because I'm so freaking hungry. I, I just bought this Sunday. The Sunday food was the interest and I really feel like I'm about to collapse because I'm so hungry. My 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 hands are already shaking. I'm in a hurry because I really wanna eat next to this Sunday. I need also sugar. Not because of this Sunday I I'm already collapsed. If you can if you can just see that yeah, how shaky my fingers are. I'm really really sorry. I actually ate brunch very early, like I ate it ten or before ten AM because I woke up very early. I usually take my brunch at eleven or past eleven. But because I woke up early today, so I got hungry very early. This Sunday is just 
just like a yeah, caramel caramelized uh, ice. I can't even taste the milk. But anyway, what, what would you expect on the cheap price? This is just a 15 peso. So it's actually Black Friday, but Filipinos don't usually uh, spend or celebrate Thanksgiving. Some does, but I actually grew up um, didn't spend Thanksgiving on the last Thursday and Friday of November. As families tradition, we actually spend our Thanksgiving on Easter Sunday. Uh, yeah. it's, it's just a family tradition. But Thanksgiving is celebrated every day for us. So my order is here. Anjo, pay up. Oh my gosh, my hand is shaking. That is clear. I bought this one. That will be expired in 2019. Saturday. Mm -hmm. 
expiration date for the toothpaste because I have that toothpaste at the house which actually expired last October 2017 and we are now November 2017 I don't know what's the danger of the bread until they see that up until today. Since I already bought a new one, I will throw it away. that cocoa oh my god I, I I actually almost teared out I'm easily to get moved that's why I really don't like drama movies anyhow hopefully I could watch Justice League maybe next time if maybe next week if I still don't have plans to go home to the province or maybe not uh, whatever anyhow December is nearly approaching Friday this week will be de December 1st and uh, I should start buying gifts to my goddaughters and godson yeah because it's time to giving gifts this year I am actually unlucky with my um, income because I used to have these two jobs, one full-time and one part-time. So I lost the full-time job, not because I was terminated, but my client closed his business. 
because it was bankrupt. However, it's a problem with on his end, not me or my output. So I have this other work which is I am really, really I'm good at. But this time it's some like very rough because she has a problem on her end financially. I have no choice but to deal with it. And I can't actually go online tonight because I lost my internet. I don't know why I restarted my computer and so on my modem. But still, no internet connection. What's the problem? I guess I gotta go to bed early today. What time is it? Oh, it's 9.40. I should get uh, to bed. And yeah, my plans for next week and for the whole month is to get back to work out not in the gym but hope workout because it's december so there are tons of holidays and gym is close on that as well as i'm going home on christmas up until new year anyhow oh my god it's been 30 minutes since i, I opened you still no internet connection so what's on my phone what's happening you know Philippine internet connection is unreliable. They're just doing business but not services. They gave you service, a good service for less than a month, but they will give you this their tradition of pissing um, customer. After a month of availing their or subscribing to their um what do you call this internet connection, they will give you this tons of shit and they are actually so good in um, billing but not on um, the services that we need our our payments can't justify the services that we uh, get from them so I'm really pissed off so I'm really hoping for a um, international telecommunication to come over here Please bring down those businessmen who actually corrupting us on our subscription, but we don't actually um, get uh, the services that we need. It's it's not justified. I got that Tesla, whatever the telecommunications in Japan, China, wherever. I do hope it will arrive very soon. Uh, I actually. Um, heard the news about that it will arrive here in the Philippines in months time so I'm so excited I will I will even pay the bridging contract of this and will and subscribe to their uh, services because Philippines internet connection is so you heard me Philippine Telecom Globe Biontel Bintel is actually acquired by Globe now. So as PLDT and Smart, F off! You're giving us no good. So uh, I'm gonna say my farewell soon. <laughs> They're giving us a lot of shit reasons that won't justify our needs. Ah, oh, you should bury yourself. And good luck, good luck, good luck to the business owners. As well as the politicians connected on this telecommunications here providing us eh, services <clears throat> so I guess I'm gonna end my rant here <laughs> this uh, vlog this week is nothing more interesting but I'm just feeling great that I am feeling better and at the same time pissed cuz of course I don't have internet connection. It's been three hours since I checked the status of my internet connection. I guess I'm gonna end this vlog so I will also stop ranting about my side as a client or subscriber of this internet connection which really sucks. So this is gonna end this week's vlog. If you agree that Philippine internet connection is like this video.
don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you're not yet subscribed at Nudge Lewis. Follow me on my social channels at Nudge Teen on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And I'll see you guys next week.